Hello, Lila. Hi. I'm KT. Hi, Lila. Nice to meet you. Please have a seat. What a sweet opportunity for Lila Patton, the 12-year-old owner of Flower Gal, to have Kent Theory of DeVita as her mentor. What prompted you to start it? Well, I've always had a passion for baking, and ever since I was little, I've just baked like box cakes and everything. So I decided one day that I'd start a cupcake business. Lila's company bakes custom and amazingly delicious cupcakes from scratch. Well, it's really hard because I recently had a 4.0 in school. Whoa. And so it was hard to maintain the cupcake business, um, sports and school. But Somehow I found a way. And I understand you have a university that you think you might want to go to in a few mm -hmm. years. Which one is that? I want to go to Princeton because it's the number one university in the nation. And uh, the cake boss, Betty Velastro, lives in New Jersey, so. I think there's any way that I can be useful to you as you go through your next year of amazing expansion and product line development. I'd like to, you to help me with shipping and then also a website, like new website ideas, and then a cart for my website so people could add th their cupcakes to the cart and know their total, and then also a logo. Uh-huh. Well, on the shipping front... He may not be the cake boss, but Mr. Theory does have 45,000 employees, or as he calls them, teammates, and I'm sure more than a few recipes for success to share with uh, Lila. However, on the website front, we have a wonderful team that does some really cool stuff with our website. Tell me a little bit about your business. Uh, I'm in what's called dialysis. Uh, which is when someone's kidney doesn't work. Kent Theory is CEO of a company whose product saves and improves the lives of people suffering from a terrible disease. Both Kent and Lila are in the business of making people feel good. So can we step over to the table and you tell me a little bit about sure. these? The, so what is this? That is a Mexicali cupcake. It's a vanilla cupcake with an avocado buttercream and jalapeno jelly. Jalapeno jelly? Yes. Whoa, and what about this one that looks like chocolate chip or something? Yes, that one. We call this one the Kent Theory. I hesitate to hear <laughs> why you call it the Kent Theory. Now be careful, there's could be children watching. <laughs> it is a chocolate cake with a cookie dough uh, filling in it, and then it has a cookie buttercream and then a f handmade cookie on top. Whoa. Well, this is, uh, if, if it's my namesake, then I get to keep it and have it <laughs> at lunch today, right? Yes. Have you ever heard that phrase, one for all yes. and all for one? Is it just me, or did anyone else wonder if Kent's all-for-one motto meant that he kept all those cupcakes for himself? 